celebrities are down to earth like this. That's one of the most profound comments I've seen in a while. Right there. That is very true. I'm following you. Uh, you want me off? You want me to uh, uh, delete my Instagram again? Because when, when I delete my Instagram, she's going to delete hers too at the same time. I'm going to delete all my social medias and I'm going to do it again. Like, relationships are supposed to have arguments or there's no love there. Well, there's disagreements, of course, but that's relationships. At least I fucking keep it real. Yeah. At least I keep it real and I'm not hiding who I am. And I'm not like, I'm perfect and my shit don't stink. Do I look like Nick Carter to you? Do I, am I around, running around, making everyone think that I'm perfect? No. No. Sorry, that's not me. That You got me confused for another brother. All right? I'm as real as it fucking gets. If you don't like it, then you're not real. You're fake. Real recognizes real, and that's why people fuck mm. with me. That's why I can't be canceled. I can't be blacklisted. I can't be nothing. People still book me shows. I still get my shit. I still make my money. I still elevate my life. I still focus on my mind, body, and soul. I focus on my family. I do what's right. When I'm checked by the law or CPS, I do everything to follow up and follow suit. Don't tell me to calm down. That's a gaslighting comment. Cassie, I'm going to let that slide. Don't, don't, you don't gaslight people with comments like that, though. It's called gaslighting. Don't tell somebody to calm down that you don't know. I can speak whatever I want. I can say however I want. Do whatever I want. This is my Instagram. It's not yours. So what gives you the right to come on my Instagram and tell me how to be? Especially in a country where we live in, in a free country. Do not do that. You chill. All right? Calm down. Why don't you go get some medicine? You like that? You like? Does it make you feel good? No, it doesn't. All right? Because if it does, you're, you're cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs, dude. Like, for real. I don't expect everybody to like, I don't need everybody to like me. I don't need everybody to love me. I don't, I don't need that. I got a family. Thank you, uh, it's Net. She said, uh, uh, you have a right to state how you feel. That's your right. Yeah, of course I do. Of course I do. And I'm always going to stick to that. I'm going to stick to my guns. Like, analytically speaking, and to the guns that I have in my safe. But you act self-titled. It's self-entitled. Get it right. And yes, I do. But get your grammar right. Can you text me? No, no, I'm on sure. my face. Sure. Yeah. Come here, please. Thank you, honey. That's like telling a woman to relax, laugh out loud. Yeah, you, you, like, you just don't, you don't do that. Amber, I'm not the nicest person. I, I, you're right, I don't put up with shit in the hateful comments that people throw at me daily. But, uh, I, um, yeah, she said, I'm sure if people had uh, them coming at their throat, they would have something to say too. Do you see that, babe? See that? See what Amber just said? She goes, Aaron is the nicest person, actually. He just doesn't put up, uh, uh, put, he just doesn't put up with uh, the hateful comments he gets on a daily. I'm sure if people had them coming at their throat, they would have something to say too. Yeah, but some people aren't as vocal as you, so they, they kind of... But the thing is, though, if, if you keep thinking about it, it's going to bottle up inside. Exactly, so that's why right? I get it out. Yeah. That's why I told you that's, that's why I'm the way I am. And people don't have to... I don't care mm -hmm. if they don't like how I, I am. If you don't like how I am, sign the fuck off and move on and do something else with your life. Mm -hmm. Why are you gawking at me? Why do I have the ability to make a blank and turn the sound off and know you're still going to be sitting here. Hmm? I'm not your fucking punching bag anymore. You're ungrateful for the life you have, and it's everyone's fault but your own. How am I ungrateful for my life? I have been in rehab. Um, I have lost family members. I'm alive. I worked my ass off. I pray to God every night, and I thank the Lord for every single thing I get. And I, I, I practice what I preach, and I'm a God, godly-driven man. 
Well, they're just coming because they it's think they're talking. They're, you're not doing music right now. Exactly. Yep. If I go That's play the piano and show how show my skills or something, do that, they don't want to pay attention. Well, if you want, if you want me to fucking be, what up, Big Mike? Yo, no Big Mike, man. I'm sure everyone love everyone. Yep, that's what I've been trying to to preach to people. But Big Mike, that that's the that's the thing. That's the reason why I, I'm like you'll see it. Like you'll come on my shit and you'll be like, what the fuck? Like someone just said I'm not grateful. I have a song called Grateful on my new album. Like, are you stupid? Like, I have a song called Grateful, like, uh, so I have a song that's called Grateful because I'm not grateful. <laughs> what? Seriously, this person said, seriously, as a victim of abuse, being called an abuser is the biggest insult, which is why Aaron is being so passionate about this topic. Leave the man alone and let him have peace. Yeah, because I've, I've, you guys have seen the abuse that I've, I've gone through. You've seen the shit. Like, you, you saw it on House of Carters. Your Bashy Boy fans come up in here, but you saw Nick punch Leslie in the face and throw me in the bathroom and try to fight me. All right? Enjoy Nick Carter then, okay? Enjoy Nick Carter, the guy who gets fucking arrested and try to use his Backstreet Boys as as a way to get out from being arrested because he choked out a bouncer at the Hogs Breath Saloon in Key West, okay? And he's banned from there, all right? Don't, come on. You want to go? Like, you want to go? You want to compare apples and oranges? We can do that. I'm an apple. Note to self, apples have more vitamin C than oranges. <laughs> That's funny. You're scared to fight me. I'm I'm not a fighter. I don't like fighting anybody. Mm, my buddy. I don't like fighting anybody. Thanks, Jenna. Yeah, yeah, Jake. Listen, listen to the LMG girls, bro. You're grateful and they're hateful. What up, iconic? I'm not doing any boxing anymore. I don't want to do it. So, remember, you don't owe anyone an explanation for who you are. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I love Mike. He's a good dude. He was, he was the, the, the guy I was talking to with the tattoos. I didn't get a chance to look. Well, I played his music. Oh, okay. I was playing his music, too. Okay. I was drowning the song. He had a, a song that he put his ex-girlfriend who died, her last voicemail on the song, just like I did with my dad. Oh, wow. Like we have like a lot in common. It's kind of crazy. <laughs> so oh, did he just stick out his tongue like you? Of course he didn't. <laughs> Look, he's laughing. He's sticking his tongue out. Look. Look. Hey. Hey. Princeton. <laughs> Show me sticky tongue out. Go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can do it. Mm. <laughs> so Preston! Preston! Preston, over here. No. Oh, hi, buddy. Yeah, that smile. <laughs> yeah. Hi, buddy. What are you doing, buddy? <laughs> yeah, I'm abusive, right? Mm -hmm. That's why my kid smiles at me at two months old. Ha, ha, ha.